it's been a while since I saw my face. I haven't been doing so great, so I took a little break. So a lot of people are saying some things about me that aren't quite true. Doesn't matter if it's true though, just as long as it's entertaining to you. Right? You guys having fun? All aboard the toxic gossip train. You try to count the tracks of misinformation. The toxic gossip train. You got one way ticket to the manipulation station. Toxic gossip train. Time into the tracks and harass me for my past. These rumors look like facts. If you don't mind the gaps, they won't survive in the crash. But hey, at least you're having fun. Uh, hi, everyone. I've been wanting to come online and talk to you about a few things. Um, even though my team has strongly advised me to not say what I want to say, I recently realized that they never said that I couldn't sing what I want to say, so... Here I am, and, um, today I only want to talk about the facts. So, I hope that you'll be willing to listen. Here we go. Many years ago, I used to message my fans, um, not in a creepy way, like a lot of you are trying to suggest, it was more of a loser kind of way, where I was just trying to be besties with everybody. It's kind of like, uh, when you go to, like, a family gathering, and there's a weird aunt there who keeps coming up to you and they're like, hey girl, what's the tea? And I'm like, mm -hmm. um, that was me, getting group chats with my fans. It was weird. I've been sharing my life online for over 15 years. I've poured my heart out to you and because of that I feel like I'm talking to my friends, but in the beginning of my career, I didn't really understand that maybe there should be some boundaries there. There were times in the DMs when I would overshare details of my life, which was really weird to me. I haven't done that for years, you see, because I changed my behavior and I took accountability. 